are here to serve you. And if there's any way that I can help you, please let me know. I'm on the first floor right over here. And my office door is always open. And again, welcome to Sunday Springs. big day for us. We ask our new people to come in a couple of days early. Uh, this morning was kind of an introduction time where they get a chance to meet and greet everyone. Uh, all the folks within the district, a lot of folks from the community, all the local banks in town and provide some goodie bags. So it's a fun morning. It kind of gives them a, a good orientation, uh, you know, uh, to get some things done before the start of school. It does. It's it's a it's a win-win situation for them and us as well. They they have an opportunity to do some paperwork with the business office. They hear from uh, some of the directors, such as special ed and elementary ed, and they'll spend some time with the curriculum directors. Uh, some of them have. Uh, some paperwork that needs to be completed prior to the start of school so it's, it's just a good head start for all of them looks like a room full today lots of new ones it, it really is it's it's a large number we have 60 new professional employees uh, when you add our new aides and secretaries we have over 80 new employees in the district uh, quite a few of those are new positions as we've expanded services and grown programs we've added some people so it's not all due to turnover but but quite a bit of it is and and, it, and it's a good group it really is uh, able to I recognized a couple of faces uh, able to keep uh, some of our former students and stuff around here it, it really is I think there's a dozen or more that are local graduates that are coming uh, to us having gone away to school uh, Three or four of them have taught for us before, uh, maybe set out to raise a family, or one or two of them left and went to another district, but have come back. So, so we have several people that are, are new this year, but they, they're familiar with the district. Well, I know they made some headway last night. Looked like, again, uh, several resignations, though, and then uh, some new hires. So I, I know that that list is being whittled down as we near the beginning of school. Here. Yeah, we, we're done. We, we have a, an aid position at our elementary campus that we're interviewing now to fill, but all our professional positions are, are filled, they're in place. Uh, we think there's a lot of quality there, uh, some new teachers, with some new ideas and some teachers with experience. We've hired some husbands and wives, so some families have united here in Sulphur Springs, so it's a good mix. Uh, I know the board has worked hard to try to be competitive with all the surrounding districts uh, to try to uh, make it easy to find those numbers. That's true. We put in place uh, last year a new salary schedule. Uh, it was a two-year cycle. This is the second year of the cycle, so there was a uh, focus and an emphasis on those early steps of, of teaching, uh, try to be competitive with schools in our area and our size. We know we can't compete with the Metroplex. We don't try to. But uh, we have a lot of things to offer other than salary that maybe you don't find in the Metroplex. But we do have a competitive salary and, and benefits package now, and I think that made a difference. All right. Uh, it's always an exciting day. This is kind of the beginning of the beginning of school to me. It is. It, yeah, it's a little head start, a little jump start, and it, it's exciting. Uh, we're all ready to get back into the swing of things and uh, a lot of excitement in there.